everybody, Jay here. Just um, I'm wondering if we should really be voting at all. I mean, I know a lot of you out there think Ron Paul sounds really good and peachy and all that, but is he really? I mean, haven't we heard this before? The promises, the woo. Haven't we been wooed by politicians before? Um. Now, I don't know if uh, Mr. Paul is a Freemason or not. He claims he, that he isn't from the little research I've done. But I did find a video that uh, shows he was in a, um, this is a Rosicrucian Lambda Chi Alpha. I'm not sure about the Rosicrucian part, but there's a clip in the video right here where this guy, uh, Jack E. Mason, Jack E. Mason, he founded the ritual for this order, and it is called a Brotherhood. There's the Wikipedia link right here. Um, is he uh, calls itself a Brotherhood? Um, it's the crescent and the cross is its insignia, or whatever you want to call it, and. Um, you know, I don't try to rely too much on Wikipedia, but, I mean, here, here's some facts. There's some facts in here. Um, but, you know, what's interesting that I found is, well, this guy here that made this video puts a bunch of links at the bottom, okay, for you to go check out, which is the, the, the shots he got in the video from, you know. So, I went to all these links in purple that I clicked, okay. And all of them have been taken down. Let me see if I left one up here. Yeah, right here. Look, that's one of those links. All of them are like this. They've been taken down. And what they've done is they've taken them down and they've created PDFs. If you go to the website, lambdachialpha.org, I think it is. Um, let me see. I'll go ahead and show you this while there. Yeah, lambda, lambdachai.org. They've taken down the web pages and put them into PDFs, and this is how they did this. Okay, and here's a picture from that website where they're throwing the, the muta, Minuto Cornuta, or the, the goat horns. Okay, see them there? Now, I'm not saying Freemasonry or these secret societies are a bad thing, but the fact that they're kept secret makes me wonder. Okay, see, there's that picture I just had up. This is at the actual website. Okay, and there's some more Minuta Cornutos, or whatever you call it, goats, horns, thrown up. Okay. So, I'll put the link to this website at the bottom. Um, and what I was looking for was this publication, because here this guy who made this video points out that, uh, there's a publication and uh, Jackie Mason pulled a bunch of his rituals. The outlines for the fraternal history were sought in such books as Hecate Horns, Secret Societies of All Ages, and da da da. And I just wanted to prove this to myself, so I couldn't find it at the website because of what they did. So I had to do a Google search and I found it. PDF dot cross and crescent. See how they, they put it in a PDF now. That's why the website is no longer there. Why would they do that? You know, I don't know, but right here is that paragraph that I found. I'll leave the link to this PDF in there. Secret Societies of All Ages, Stevens Cyclopedia Fraternities, copies of which are now in the Central Office Library, books on mystery cults of Egypt, the Orient, Greece, and Rome by such authors. No, that's not a bad thing, necessarily. Okay. As far as I've seen, Ron Paul has no affiliation with Freemasonry. Okay, but this is a secret over a secret order here or brotherhood with uh, mystery cult uh, initiations going on or rituals. So I'm not saying those are bad things either because I'm no longer uh, you know big uh, proponent of the Bible, although I believe the teachings of the Christ are legit and I'll get into that in a later video. but Regardless of whether he was a real man that really walked the earth or not, I believe the teachings are, are 
true a lot of the teachings not all of them but a lot of them are true to our true spirituality um but there are also things that buddha said there are also things that uh, krishna have said so i think they were taken and put into uh maybe the words of this jesus that they talk about in the bible um so uh But I, I, I do believe a lot of those teachings are important. But anyway, uh, I don't think we should be... I'm not sure if we should be voting for Ron Paul. I, I'm not sure we should be voting for everybody. Anybody. I think maybe we should boycott the whole damn system and not vote at all. Okay? We're just playing their game by voting. We're just playing their game. And if anything, if Ron Paul is the real deal, then they're just going to steal the election from him. Now, that's one way we can test the system, by voting for Ron Paul. We can get enough people behind him to vote, and we know for sure that he would have won, but how can you really know? So, I mean, we shouldn't even play their game at all. We don't need you government. We don't need to be, we don't need a daddy okay we don't need to be saved we don't need any protection from you we can protect ourselves we can police ourselves it's happened before we can and we can do that we don't need anybody um watching over us we don't need anybody telling us we can smoke pot we don't need or we can't smoke pot we don't need tell anybody telling us anything we were born on this earth to be told what to do that's there's something wrong with that so um i'm not even sure we should vote at all but that's my little rant for today just wanted to show you guys some of that i'll leave the links to that pdf below i'll leave the link to the cross and the crown below i'll leave the link to my website below where i also uh, write and share uh news stories from other uh sources and i do have a newsletter that you can sign up for as well um the sign up box is right there name and email nothing big i don't ask for your phone number or any of that jazz and i'll send you out some free uh pdfs and and stuff and every now and then i might promote a book that i can't find for free on amazon or something but um i found some really good pdfs that i can share with you and stuff like that if you want to sign up for my newsletter um and Visit my blog, reddawnpost.com. Uh, if you found this video valuable, you know, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. What do you think? you really think we should vote? I mean, I'm not trying to be a Ron Paul basher here. Uh, I'm not saying uh, being in a secret society is a bad thing. The fact that it's secret is kind of a bad thing, but, you know, whatever. Should we just not vote at all that's what i'm leaning towards not voting at all because we heard this song and dance before we get all giddy and emotional and happy inside and then what's he can't do anything without congress's approval there are still democrats and republicans that don't agree with him in congress so keep that in mind as well all these things he says he's going to do it doesn't mean he's going to do them okay this might just be another way to divide people, another way to fool us. So, you know, the links are in the description area. Take care.